Hello guys, it's RPM from Technique Box and today I will teach you how to make an HTML page and make a, a small box on the right side of the page and give scrolling test in it. You can put news or any other update in that box and for that you will have to open your text editor. You can use Notepad if you are using a Windows machine. I'm using a Linux machine right now. For that I have a text editor called Gedit and I'm opening now. Here's the Gedit text editor and then in your text editor you have to type in the html tag and then you have to st uh, st make a head tag yep that's it and then you have to open your title tag to give in your title let me put test page for now and then close the title tag then you have to make associate your HTML page to your CSS page which you are making later. For that you will have to put link rel is equal to style sheet and then put a space and then type rough is equal to style dot CSS. Yep, style.css is the page, I mean the file which you are making uh, after making the HTML page and this is the cascading style sheet page. Then you have to close the head tag like that and then you have to open the body tag, that's fine and then you have to make the do class tag. class equal to um, box maybe yep that is fine and then uh, put a space there and close the div tag then you have to close your body and HTML tags let me close that And then you are done with the HTML thing for now. Now you have to save that wherever you need. Save it as index.html. And that's done. Click on the save button. And then create a new tab on the text editor. Or yeah, do something like that. And you got a clear screen there. Then you have to put dot and then the name which you are given right um here in the div class tag let me put box for now and then you have to um, put the height uh, the 250 pixel may be fine and then put the semicolon on the end then type in the width of your box that may be 100 100 yeah maybe 150 pixel then put the semicolon at the end after that uh, you have to make your this uh, border decision border uh, 2 pixel solid you have to decide your color I'm using black for now as my power color is the 2 pixel solid solid black ok that's fine and then you have to uh, uh, arrange the box to which side you need for that you have to type in float right you can put left right or something else right there and then you have to close that you're done with that save it on the same file you have saved that the other html file save it as style dot css Click on the save button 
and we are done with that open your index.html file you can see a box right here and now you have to put some text in it right here you can uh, uh, put something like scrolling text first of all let me put the heading that is some kind of news you can make an underline on that heading then put in your name I mean the uh, heading name close the u tag that's the underline tag and then make a break uh -huh. now we have to type in your news then make a break br tag then type in the other news you can make as much as you need and before you make this news there you have to create another tag called the mark you tag and then press space there don't close the tag make a space there and type in direction equals to up then below the every news you make close the mark you tag mark you tag there and you're done with your web page um, let me reload that now we can see that the news calls you and you can adjust the resolution I mean the size of the box and you can make that really looking good um, let me decrease say 50 pixel or something there it will look pretty good height yeah 200 pixel may be fine that's fine and let me reload that oops that's a bit high let me put 225 pixel and yeah that's done that's fine and we can give color to that by giving the background background like that and then you can use any color you need I'm using f3 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 for now for the semicolon then save that and reload that you can see that the color is changed and look pretty good that's it guys thanks for watching see you in the next video please click that subscribe button and stay tuned my stay tuned for my more videos click on the like button that helps me a lot bye see you in the next video